it is a new day it's a mild day but it is pretty rainy so i'm taking my thick winter coat that i bought at the great yorkshire show earlier this year we're heading to lake burnley today and then my niece has a horse riding lesson later and we're going to something else after that as well I've come around the back of the house again to quickly vlog but today we are heading to a farm near my dad's house and the sun has actually come out I was gonna wear a dress my sister's wearing a dress but it feels quite chilly and breezy it feels a lot warmer than it did the other day it said it was 21 the other day and it felt like literally 10 today it says it's 14 degrees but it feels more like 16 so it's really tricky when to know what to do I have got like a top that I do wear as a dress with shorts but I have popped some leggings on underneath so I don't get too cold and chilly because I do not want to feel like I did the other day. My makeup looks terrible in that lighting. In orange, sporty in green, and posh in red. Hmm. So now, what I need you to do is to set another corner. Let's chit chat in orange, but right on the table. Oh, look at that. It's going to be a coming up the outside there over the first hurdle. It's neck and neck between scary and danger. <laughs> and who's it going to be over the finish line? We are in Maisie's Maze. And we've all split up and gone different ways. So we'll see if we find each other. I was going to say, is this the song? We are back from the farm and it's only just really started to warm me up in the last hour, which has been nice. Just having a little look around dad's garden and he's built a new pond with a big waterfall. Oh, 
I'm out of breath. We have come to Lake Vermeer and we're just walking to the waterfall. I have actually not been very well at all since I got back from Wales. I ended up having two days in bed, felt a little bit better, so I went to work for my first night shift. And for the first time ever in seven years, over seven years, I had to leave work halfway through. So I lasted about four hours before I had to come home. And since then, I haven't left bed. So this is the first time out of the house in a week and I've missed the first three wedding events, but it is my cousin-in-law's brother's wedding. He is Sikh and it is night four, and then the actual wedding is on Sunday. survived last night it was very loud but so by the end of it I did have a bit of a headache which was annoying um but spent quite a bit of time in the downstairs bar which was really quiet with Dylan just watching Peppa Pig <laughs> and chilling which was very much needed I ended up leaving at about half past ten um because I cleverly blundered to take Dylan and Emma home my nephew and my cousin and now I'm just waiting for mum to get here because we're going out for some brunch and then we're going to um, head down to Kent for the ceremony tomorrow. We have been to the Gurdwara for the temple ceremony and we've just got to the reception. It's very hot.
I feel so well, I can't catch my breath. And I called 999.